Hello, welcome, my name is Eddie. In this quick video, we'll show you all of the bells and whistles that you need to know when using Sizely and becoming a more successful seller when it comes to boosting your sales, reducing customer returns, and then also being more efficient when selling and running your own business. Quick fact, most of the questions that, that sellers are getting are related to measurement, size, and fitting. With Sizely, that essentially alleviates all of the questions that you're getting and hence making you a more effective seller and a business owner. Before we get started with Sizely, you have access to over 300 different designs in case you're selling clothing items such as vests, cardigans, sweatshirts, t-shirts, jackets, or even other items such as glasses, sunglasses, shoes, accessories, belts, caps, hats, even jewelry. Uh, as well as luggage, furniture uh, items, all of those designs we have present. Uh, fun fact, we even have designs for clothing, uh, for dog clothing. So in other words, the rule of thumb that we have here at Sizely, if you need a design to help you with the measurements, please message us. We will have it listed for you in no time. Quick note here, with Sizely, you can generate also size charts as well as single size templates that only focus on one particular item. And then also there are work across all platforms and marketplaces such as Etsy, eBay, Tradesy, Shopify, Poshmark, Amazon, and so on. If you have your own e-commerce solution, Sizely will also work on that as well. So now let's get started and create a single template. So now we're in the template creator. So here, let's get started with a bottom-down uh, shirt. So here we have a couple of options. One rule of thumb is you can list as many or as little measurements as you wish. So in this case, we'll be listing three different measurements, one for the chest, and in this case, I'm just filling in dummy data, and then the waist, and then the hip. And then also, please know that you have also the option to type in all of the measurements in inches or in centimeters. You also have for international buyers, the option to display both centimeters and inches on the output template. So in this case, we included three different measurements. And again, you can include as many or as little as you want. And then also you can have for your own purposes, have uh, the brand, the model and the size uh, uh, typed in. This will essentially help you organize all of your listings uh, with Sizely. So now let's go ahead and click generate. Here we go. Now you have a couple of options to uh, share your template, be it in this case via URL, have it also embedded on any uh, platform that you're using, or in other words, you can also download that image. So now let's actually take a look. So here you, you essentially have the bottom down shirt as well as the measurements in inches and centimeters. And that took pretty much a couple of seconds for us to generate. So now let's go back to uh, the to back to the template and create a size chart. So here we essentially have more options. Here we essentially have the options to include multiple sizes, and then this will allow us to create a size chart. So in this case, let's do medium, let's do large, and then let's do extra large. And then for the measurements, I can pretty much include the measurements that I wish for each individual section that then will be displayed. The rule of thumb here again, you can include as many or as little measurements uh, in, the, in, in the size chart as you wish. So in this case, let's click generate. And here it is. So in this case, this size chart looks a little bit uh, smaller because it only has two items. But as you can see here, we have three different sizes with each representing uh, the measurements for the length and the cuff in uh, inches as well as centimeters. So this is it with a quick overview of Sizely and how it works. I hope you're curious to test it out, to try it out, and then ultimately become a more successful and uh, efficient seller in the future. Thank you so much, and I see you soon.